guys, Simply Betty here. I'm about to unbox something from Ray's Aquaria, something that I won. I won this. Ray's Aquaria had a fish naming contest for her new betta fish, and my contribution won. I think Dandy is a wonderful name. Not only did I win a gift certificate to Aquarium Co-op, I also got a box. Let's open it. Okay guys, here's the box from Ray's Aquaria. I'd recommend anyone to go check out her channel. I'll have it linked down below. It's it's fun, I like Ray. She has some pretty dang good videography. I always love her shots. And when she shows all of her cool tanks. So go sub to her if you haven't already. Ugh. Oh boy, she sent me some swag. And this is swag that some people from different channels have contribu contributed to her naming contest, which was really nice of everyone to do that. I thought it was pretty sweet. Like for example, let's open this up. Aquarium Co-op contributed this really cool measuring glass. It has teaspoons and tablespoons and ounces and milliliters with the Aquarium Co-op logo right there. That was pretty nice. As well as, ooh, stickers and magnets from Aquarium Co-op. Sweet, stick those somewhere. And Sergeant Tank was nice enough to contribute one of his sweet shirts. I'll get a shot of me wearing it. Look at that. That's pretty badass. Well, bristle nose plucko, Sergeant Tank. I'll get an up close shot of that. And then, wait, what's this? Whoa, look, it's a towel with Sergeant Tank's logo on it. Neat, and you can hang it from things. This is cool, I love it. It will go great with my aquarium co-op hanging towel. Now, if one gets dirty, I'll just go to the other one. Right on. I love it. Okay, I'm gonna wear this. Check it out. I love my new Sergeant Tank t-shirt. I love my bristle nose pleco on there. Fits nice. Thank you, Sergeant Tank, for contributing this sweet t-shirt to Ray's naming contest. Fits very nice. Whoa, guys, is this the next day and I have another box from Ray's Aquaria? What could it be? Okay, here we go. Yes, Ray's Aquaria sent me another box. I think this was her first time shipping something live. I think, I'll have to double check with her. But oh man, I'm excited because these are going to be some beautiful, 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 little, adorable, colorful ram's horn snails. And oh my, they're packed really well. Look at this. She made a styrofoam box. Oh, a cooling pack. That's cool, good touch. Ray's Aquaria, and I'm nervous. I really, really hope this turned out nicely. I told Ray that if she sent me some of her nice snails, which I really wanted, uh, we would trade, and I'd send her some bettas. There is the plastic bag, a couple plastic bags bagged together, and there's a paper towel inside, which I'm assuming the snails are wrapped up in. So, See, I'm just taking this lump here and I'm going to put it directly into my nice room temperature bucket. I'm gonna open up the paper towel in the water. That would be so sad if they don't make it, mostly just because I know Ray's Aquaria put a lot of effort into getting these guys to me. Okay, I'm getting them out of their paper towels and they're just, they're floating. I don't know if that's just what ram's horns do or if that means they are dead. I sure hope that does not mean that they are dead. I don't really know anything about snails. These are some of my first snails that I've ever really had. Let's see, I have some mystery snails that I got from Steenfot Aquatics. And now I have these ram's horn snails in different colors. I have had my eye on pink ram's horn snails for so long now because they're just the cutest little things I've ever seen. She didn't have very many either, so it was pretty nice of her to, to send me some of her really limited supply. All right, all right. I think I have them all out. Sweet! Immediately, they are perking up and coming out of their shell. Here, I'll show you. Check these guys out. These are some of her blues. 
they're poking out of their shells. And there's also some cute little pinks. I'm just going to keep them in this bucket for a little while and feed them and make sure they're doing okay and then I'll put them in one of my tanks tonight. Thanks Ray for sending me snails. I think they're super cute and I love them. Everybody go check out Ray's channel. I have it linked right here. And be sure to like and subscribe to both of us and have a great day.